Excuse you. Oh, oh. Excuse you. Excuse you. Rain. Say hi to the camera. Say hi to the camera. Oh, God. Just wiped out in my bun, bro. Y'all, this dog. Oh! <laughs> Please stop. Mom's about to record a video. And your brother's being good, and you're not being good at all. Okay, you gotta stop, bro. You. Meh, meh. I appreciate getting sneezed on in the back of the bun. <laughs> What's going on, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. It's Shantae Marie here. I'm a military lifestyle vlogger on the tube. And if you guys are new, make sure you hit the subscribe button so you can continue to see more videos like this. I'm gonna hurry up and wait for you guys to hit that subscribe button. Did you do it? Did you do it yet? Good. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you to everyone who has taken the time to subscribe to my channel. I truly appreciate it. So I'm doing a video that's a little bit different because I wanted to bring this back to my channel, but I wanted to put a twist on it because before my channel used to be beauty related and now I do like my lifestyle and I want to share everything that I'm enjoying for the month with you. So I figured what better way to do that than to have a monthly favorites video again. So thumbs up for monthly favorites videos on my channel. I want to know what your guys' favorites are. Comment that down bar below. I love to interact with you guys. I love to talk to you guys, chit chat, hang out. I just really like to communicate with you guys. So I want to know what you have been loving as well. So the first item that we are going to talk about is my new boots. I showed in my last vlog that I had received a new pair of boots. I don't know why I said received. I paid for them with my own money. I went to Fort Riley and got these boots and I said I was gonna do a review on them and I hadn't had time to do that yet. So the boots just come in this box and these are called I got a size seven and a half, first of all. They're men's sizes. And I got the Nike SFB Field 28, 28 leather. I don't really, I'm gonna just show you this box. They were $174 at Patriot Outfitters in the PX. And damn, they be charging tax. I did not know that. They charge tax, I guess. That's crazy. Um, so they ended up being $188.55 altogether, but these boots are phenomenal. Um, I like for my boots to be lightweight. I mean, granted, I'm not like in a combat situation right now or anything, but I like my boots to be light. I don't like heavy boots. They just drive me crazy. And I wore the Rocky like 2.5, 2.0s for the longest time. Those boots are so comfy, but they are heavy. Like these boots are, I mean, it's basically like you're wearing a tennis shoe. They're, they do have a little bit of weight, but it's nothing compared to other boots that I've tried. I have tried so many pairs of boots. I have probably spent thousands of dollars on boots because I just I don't know, I wanna be comfy and I have to wear these every day. So one of the things I really liked about them is like these do have the Nike logo right there and then they have the Nike logo on these little clasps right here and they say trail frame. I guess I didn't notice that it said that. But the bottoms have so much grip on them and that comes in really handy because when they're like cleaning the floors at work, I, I, I've, almost slipped like a thousand times and that's never happened in these. Um, the one thing if I had to like say something that I don't like about them, well one is the cost and two, um, these are very hard to break in. I've been wearing these for almost a month now and they're still not broken in. They're so hard for me to put on because basically from here up is like super tight. These are so improved. Like the Nike boots have come a long ways, y'all. I do want to put out there that if you guys are going to basic training, um, you are required to wear the boots that are issued to you. So like, I wouldn't bother buying something like that. All right, so since we are still talking about army crap, I guess I will talk about this bag. This is my go bag that I just received from our recruiting and retention battalion. And 
I love this bag. It's like very small, but it seriously holds so much. There's a thousand pockets in this bag. Let's see if there's something random that I can pull out. Like my knee brace for basketball is in here. Um, I legit carry this thing everywhere with me. Like, okay, this is kind of, I have Dramamine in here. Like, if you do not have a go bag, I highly recommend that you have a go bag. Like, everyone should have a go bag. Even if you're not in the military, y'all need a go bag. So, I got that for free from Recruiting and Retention, but there are very similar bags that you can buy online. And by the way, I will have everything that's in this video in the down bar. Next is workout, some workout stuff. Um, I wanted to show these leggings because the one thumbnail that I posted in my video the other day, I was wearing these and you guys were like, girl, yo booty though. <laughs> Your booty looks so good in these. These are actually Gymshark and I can honestly say their seamless leggings have come so far. Like, way further than I expected. I will say that the first generation of seamless leggings that I purchased were so ungodly small that like I've never been able to wear them. They're children's size. So I up went up a size in these and I honestly could have, like I could have been a medium or a small. So anyways, these like, I'm obsessed with this color. Gymshark calls it khaki. Um, I bought the matching, so I bought the matching top as well, and I am obsessed, bro. Are you guys seeing these baby gains up in here? Um, but yeah, I love these. I get compliments uh, on them at the gym, and they're also, like, very thick. They're not super thin. I have some Gymshark leggings that are really thin, but, like, these take the cake. I want to buy these in every color. Basically, anything Gymshark make, makes that's this color... I'm buying. Where's my pin? I'm signing. I got a new pair of contacts. These are the most beautiful con colored contacts that I've ever had in my life. Um, they are specifically, I think they are specifically made for people who have dark eyes. I have always wanted to have green eyes. Like, like, Jesus, Lord, thank you for the beautiful brown eyes that you gave me, even though, you know, one of them is messed up and I have to wear the thickest damn glasses ever. But I'm not mad because my eyes are so dark that people think they're black. Like, I'm not mad at it. But sometimes, you know, your girl just wants to switch it up. These contacts are banging. I'm actually going to have a review on them. But in the case, you get like a little contact case and then... They come just like right any other contacts like individually in these little little containers. So I have two more items that I really loved this month. And these two are for working out as well. Well, one of them's not. It's just like some health items. And then I also have a Zonk, which we'll get into that in a little bit. But um, the first item that I have been obsessed with is this Ghost Warheads pre-workout. I almost called it protein. Uh, this is the bomb. I didn't know what to do. I tried just doing coffee like I used to do and like my body, my body's intolerance to caffeine is a little bit nuts right now because I love coffee and I haven't been able to drink it in a, in a while because it's making me sick. Anyways, I have not had any issues with this. This taste exactly like warheads and they are coming out they i guess a uh, ghost actually like worked and networked with um swedish fish and i think sour patch kids and like sour patch kids is my shit y'all like i love sour patch kids i love sour patch kids i love sour patch kids and i like warheads too i forget about that as a candy in general this tastes exactly like it. Speaking of ghost, the other thing is I haven't I haven't used this in quite some time because my working out has not been consistent and protein if you're protein can make you fat. So, especially cuz there's like hella sugar in it, but this one is 140 calories. Oh, 2 grams of sugar. So, that's like kind of low, 
but I don't see how they do that because this protein is called peanut butter cereal milk and I shit you not, <laughs> but I, I'm, <laughs> I'm not that old. I shit you not, this protein tastes like peanut butter, what? Peanut butter cereal milk. That's what it tastes like. It tastes exactly like it. It's so weird. I, it's so weird. So I like to put it in the blender with a scoop of peanut butter and like almond milk. Oh my God. Oh my God. It's so, it's heaven. It's like a freaking Reese's peanut butter cup. Anyways, this is heaven. Uh, I used a code for Christian Guzman to buy that because I just wanted to see what the hype was about. I didn't expect to like for it to be good, you know, because he's an affiliate. So anyways, let's move on to the zonk. So if you guys don't know what a zonk is, a zonk is like when you go to formation in the military um, for PT and basically uh, whoever gets up in front of the formation, like your first sergeant or whatever, they will like get up and call y'all to attention and then be like, and they'll say zonk. And when that is said, everybody literally just runs as fast as they can to their cars and goes home. It's usually done when like the, there's bad weather and stuff um, for PT, but it basically means like, like run, like run away. So in my favorites videos, we are going to be doing zonks if I have one. It's just something that I've purchased that I don't think that you guys should waste your money on. So today's zonk, <clears throat> let me grab it. Today's zonk is this pair of tennis shoes. I have worn the hell out of these to be honest, but these are legit the worst Nikes that I've ever had. And I see other people wearing them and I'm like, how? I purchased these at the PX because I was shocked that I could buy a pair of Nikes for $50 without tax but i know why these were 50 dollars now um within a week of wearing them the nike emblem like started to come off i uh, i don't know how that happens but it started to come off they're just like very poorly made nikes but they're good enough like i've just turned them into like my outdoor running shoe. I, I guess I do wear them to the gym, but they're like a pair of shoes that I could give two craps about. I really need to go buy a pair of black tennis shoes that I like plan to keep nice to wear. Like I'm just, I haven't bought tennis shoes in so long. Um, after buying those boots though, I don't got money to buy shoes because that one pair of boots was so expensive. But, um, these are, they say Nike training. They say Nike flex on the side. I guess they're the Nike Flex, I'm assuming TR8 means trainer. Um, this is what the tongue, this is what the, this is what the tongue looks like in case you're wondering. Um, but yeah, they're very cute, but very cute, but not worth the $50. Thank God I only spent $50 on these hoes. Like, thank God I only spent $50 on these, so I don't feel as bad. But anyways, today, that is it for you guys. That was my zonk. Those were my favorites. Once again, let me know what your guys' favorites for the month were in the comments below. Make sure you thumbs up this video. Subscribe if you have not already, and I will catch you guys in my next video.